Greetings and welcome back to Against the Storm. I'm Catherine Sky, and let's continue right where we left off. Okay. Oh, lizards are helping us. Hooray. High resolve 0 0.1 per minute. That's super high. <laughs> yeah. It's that time. So, okay. What have we got here? Library. We need to have somebody working at the tavern. So let's have beaver maybe or human. Yeah. Hello? Oh, human happier. Human is happier working there. Let's go with the human then. All right, we have people working here. That's great. Oh, things are going pretty well. Quite happy about this. Is it still 45? It is. Okay. Very nice. And then this is a little bit higher. <laughs> Not much. It's 0 0.2. It's doubled. Wow. <laughs> yes. The doubling is real. Okay, so these folks are doing their thing. This is our library. We do need to focus on this. We can do education. I want to see. Let's see. Clothier, rain mill. Uh, oh, uh, clothier, rain mill, and scribe. I don't have any of those. We need probably the clothier would be the best. Okay. Can we do anything to fix this? Let's see if I fire everybody here. If it goes down. I don't think it does. I think we discovered on the last one, even if it's at zero... It oh no, it fixed. Hooray! Okay, good. So that fixed itself. That was quite nice. But it would be nice to build some other houses. Now, we don't actually have any bricks, so life is... Oh, you know why also life is rough? Hmm? This is an important point. Apparently, KOS is allergic to building trading posts. So we don't actually have one yet, and I don't know how that happened. It is a very strange idea, but yes, it is not there. So yeah, let's build one. Let's build one right here. There we go. Chuck it in there and that will be built pronto, I hope. Let's go. I actually have tons of wood. I could do that 250 wood thing if we have the rest of the other stuff. I don't remember what it was. It like luxury goods or something? Oh, no, it was... Pack of provisions, makeshift post, granary, or provisioner, which we do have the makeshift post, of course. We start out with that building. Let's see. No. We can't see what you can put in. I always like to check, but yeah, sometimes you don't get it. It's a bit rough. Wow. Okay. At least we have plenty of workers. Maybe with the workers, I think... Eh, I think nothing, actually. I was going to put some roads in, but I don't think we actually have much in the way of choice here with that. I guess we can put in a few. There's not much else to do. Can move this one slightly to finish that. And then move the road to go maybe around this, like this. And maybe do a road here, potentially. I don't know if it's worth putting a mine in here. We can do a few roads, but not all of them. We'd like to discover some more rocks or clay. That would be nice. This one does have quite a few charges though. It's got 50 left. So if we get another beaver here or another somebody over there, it could be quite good. All right, I'm gonna put in uh, the beavers again here. Just get them working. And in the meantime, I think I'm going to buy some... I might buy some rocks or something. All right, where is this? Okay, there they are. There we go. Yay. Go, go, go. Hooray. Can move this down. Like there. So at least... So if, if I'm inattentive, they'll still do something. Okay, we do have ancient sewing technique. That's nice. Oh, biscuits. Okay furnishings that's always such a nice perk i think we're gonna go with this we can't really afford too much here but uh i would like to get something let's see they do have bricks but no clay that's a bit disappointing i think we'll go with this the resolve for villagers with a home i want to get some bricks i want to get at least i don't know like 10 bricks maybe 12. okay and then we're going to pay for this. I think we can pay with copper, really. Just the whole thing. Okay, that's fine. And then maybe, what else? 
I don't think we're doing much with copper right now. Resin is nice to have. It's used for incense, I think, maybe. We can probably use it instead of leaves, which we don't have any leaves anymore anyway, so it's probably good to do that. Let's see, we can probably do this as well. Okay. There we go. We're getting some bricks. That's good. Let's check that incense as well. Yeah, leaves. We don't have any. So I'm going to use the resin. Wow, that's 10 and 5. To, oy, that's a lot. That's kind of a lot. Oh, well, it's fine. It is fine. All right, so what else have we got here? We have more humans, so that's good. We get two beavers. Let's go ahead and do this. I'd rather have more humans than beavers, to be perfectly honest. Um, okay, we need them to stay. Huh. Well then, <laughs> how do we convince them? Who knows? Okay, so the crown doesn't need to know everything. That's nice. Oi. Harvesting and planting. I wonder if harvesting applies to gathering. Maybe not, because gathering is gathering, right? Going out to the wild to gather. And if we commit to not making farms, then we could actually do that. That might be good. That that wood production is doubled. That's kind of great. Okay, let's go. Let's do the thing. Oh, discovering glades kills one villager? That would have worked too, because we get we get a new villager every time we open a glade, so this would be perfect. <laughs> okay, so um right. I wanted to build some other houses. Especially for, I guess, for lizards, maybe, and humans. At least a couple of them. There's a couple human houses. Uh, there's a couple of lizard houses. Let's see. I want to do something like that. There we go. Like this. That seems okay. So that's eight bricks, and we bought ten. So I think we have a couple in storage as well. Like four in storage. So if we need to build a bigger building, we could do that as well. We have many beavers. Why Why do we have so many beavers? Is it because of people joining? Joining up? I don't know. Okay, so Hilda, thank you so much. But, bye-bye. Alright. I really want another point. I want more clothes. I want clothes. Yeah, because we have no knowledge. Do we have... Um, oh, we need to look at this and find out. In our... Oh, we have a library. Hello! Anybody like working here? Beavers should. They could eat all the books. Uh, <laughs> Alright, so these things are build... Okay, Clothier, Rainy Mill, and Scribe. I don't think we have... Uh, we, don't, we definitely don't have those cards right now. But we might get some in the future. That's good. Okay, so we are getting some jerky. This is fantastic. What was that again? Hello? Done humans? We done, done, done the humans. All right. And it gives us a farm. Hooray! Which we don't need. Oh boy, we have new stuff. Okay. Um, hmm. Grove. Vegetables, insects, and grain. I kind of want to reroll. We don't have enough to reroll though. No. Yeah, here's the farm. Vegetables, insects, and grain. We have uh, that's wheat. I guess that would work. We don't I don't think I see any vegetables though. Alright, here is more wheat. We have also more copper. There. So let's go ahead and move you over here. You can keep on like opening this glade up here, for example. Okay, scavenger's camp has no nearby anything. So that's not good. Let's see. Can we move this? What do they take? Reeds, eggs, and fiber. There's eggs here. Do we need food? I don't think we actually need food. So I'm going to put this, uh, actually leave it where, I'll put it here, and then just fire our human employee because there's not much we can do about that. What do these people need? They need tools. Do we have any? We do. Okay. We can give them tools and they can give us fabric. 
and herbs or victory points. We are so tasty for those. Well, tasty for those. We are hungry for those. We don't want to be tasty. <laughs> that gives the wrong impression to the monsters out there, I feel. Yes. Okay. Oh, we have some houses happening. Hooray. This is good. This is extremely good, in fact. Okay, so... Happy times are here again. Now then, woodcutters are 45. That's not going to put us down on hostility, alas. So we're going to have to keep on chopping and going through and all the things. For whatever reason, we have so many materials here. I am quite excited about what's going on. But I, man, I want to reroll that so bad. Eh, but we don't have enough thingies. No, no amber. A lot of these glades have nothing in them. Now, what do we have in the way of... Oh, we have lots of planks. We could actually open a new glade. We could do that. I'm kind of thinking like a big glade is what I'm thinking. Like that one. Major threat. This is very dangerous. Hmm. I'm kind of wondering, though, if it's worth to anger the forest more. Probably not, I would say. Let's see what was going on over here. So we don't actually have anything open here. It might actually be time to start stopping. As in stop opening more glades. Okay, so we actually... Oh, we have 10 amber? How did we get that? That seems nice. Okay, let's go ahead and get this one. This gives us veggie production and 20 amber. I'll take it. Very nice. All right, so this one, again, was... Oh, producing random stuff. Okay. All right, we have three buildings now. I think we'll take the camps. Take the camps. Now then, we have a brewery, carpenter, or the apothecary. We could build the incense here. It should be a bit cheaper. Um... Because, yeah, last time, though, we did the tried to go with cheap stuff. It didn't actually work very well. So we could use insects, but I think we're going to take this off. Uh, all right, let's just choose well here. The brewery will make ale, but we don't actually have... Do we have things to make ale? Let's see. We can use grain or roots, neither of which we have. We could grow some. Uh, we could do wine. We have tons of berries, but no pottery. If we look at the tavern, we can only do tea. We cannot do uh, wine, alas. So let's check this again. Did, is there something that makes tea? Oh, look at that. The apothecary makes tea. Okay, we're taking that. Okay, carpenter. Wow. Wow. A big bunch of nothing here. Trade goods. We could do trade goods. Don't we have a thing for trade goods? Or somewhere? Is it the one we didn't take? No, it's provisions. Hmm. Okay. That's not ideal. We could re-roll this one. I don't know if it's worth it or not. We have... Alright, let's build what we have here. I think that's a better idea and just like see what's going on with stuff okay let's put this one here and they can build the incense out of what insects there's only five wow five insects huh all right let's make 30 alt or maybe maybe we'll do 50 actually 50 here and then tea we will take wow insect tea as well we can do all the things this is great uh, all right. This is a bit rough. I think we're going to have to figure out something here. I think we should grow... We can grow uh, herbs or roots. The production is extremely bad, but uh, it, it can be made to work. So let's delete this part and build ourselves a new farm. We do have the herb garden, so we're going to build herbs, I think, because it has the most benefit from herbs. I'm going to stick that in there because herbs are two stars. They produce four of them versus two roots. 
So we're going to put this on a higher priority. And let's get those farm fields organized. There we go. So that should work, I hope. Um, not really sure, but we'll see. We'll see how it goes. Okay, so that's a thing. And then, what else do we have? We had another building, I thought. Uh, the apothecary, we already made that. Okay, so that's fine. Did we do limits for tea? No. Let's do a limit of, I don't know, 40 on tea and 30 on incense and no biscuits. Okay. All right. So we're good. We are very good. Happiness has been achieved. <laughs> right, right? You know? Okay. Trade goods, aye, luxury goods. I'm. Uh, how much uh, do we have? I want to talk to the trader and see if there's anything good. I guess that number won't change, so it's fine. All right, happiness is happening. Oh, here, we can actually see how many per minute. 0 0.03. And how much here? Hello? Hello? No? 0 0.26. Okay, do we have any buildings? Here we need some humans, so there we go. Put them in here. And they can start a farm in all the stuff. What do we have here? We have eggs. We have so much stuff, though. I don't think we actually need any more food production. I'm quite content with what's going on currently. Okay, we do need people working here, though. Let's have a beaver, maybe. Uh, yeah, I think that's enough. One is enough. I don't think we actually have materials for tea yet. So that's going to be, you know, there. But looks like we have tons of jerky. That is really good. We're not lacking. Because that can be a pain in the socks if you don't have enough. So I'm going to put this up to 60 just to be like proactive there. Okay. And I don't know if we need two lizards there or not. Let's pause. And here we have, yay, roots. Hooray. That's exciting. Uh, <laughs> it's like, huh? Why? Uh, so four times 25, that's a hundred roots. That's quite a lot of roots. Mm. Okay, so we're now at uh, danger point two, hostility two. We could probably delete some woodcutters to bring that down a bit. Oh, yep, yep. And now is the time to do that. Okay, bye, bye, bye. Okay, yeah, we're at one now. That's good. Hooray. All right, this other woodcutter. Hmm. I am unsure what to do about this. I think, I think we might just clear this area here. Might clear that and then put a farm in here or potential farm. Do we have enough beaver houses? We can actually do something about that. Oh, we have the supplier. Carpet. Oh, no. Ha, I got excited for nothing. No, 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 no. I don't know why it plinged at me. It's like, eh, confusion. But what we can do is get some housing going on. Some more beaver houses would be great. I don't know why they're kind of lagging behind in happiness. Uh, because it feels like we have enough houses for them. It's just they're not being happy enough. We need to encourage this happiness so that it doesn't like spread to everyone else. Let's see, it's three for these folks. And then here we have eight. Wow, that's impressive. Okay, so we need more human houses. But it does feel like we need definitely more stone. We're not getting a lot of stone. So it's a bit like, huh. Okay, so this could do a road going this way. And taking there, that way. Just going like that, potentially. All right, we can get our beavers back on the job. All right. I guess we move them down here where it's a little bit safer so we can just chop a bunch of trees in this area because we don't really want to open any more groves right now. Okay, so we definitely need... There's beaver houses. Do we have bricks? Four. Hmm. Where's Sahilda? Where are you, girl? Did I miss her? I might have. Okay, on the way. No, I didn't miss her. That's good. Okay. All right. We have more people who want to come in. 
I don't know if it's necessary. <gasps> Ooh. Oh boy. Okay, well now we have things. So three pottery per minute or stone production. That's nice. Or 50% of the amount to the amount of goods produced in the brewery. Well, we're not using a brewery, so let's take that one off right away. Three pottery per minute is kind of good because I forgot that we don't actually have anything to put in there. So I think that's what we're going to get. I'm going to use this one. I think that's what we need to do. So, yay. Uh, and this, hmm, I don't know what to do about that, but what do we got here again? Hey, we always have the same thing. I was like, oh, <laughs> hello, help. Pack of provisions, trade goods, nope, nope, and more nope. Now, Sahilda, we need you. Hello. Hello, hello, where are you? Okay, here we go. I want to look at this stuff that she has. Okay. And thanks. Gain 20 pottery for each glade. Oh my god, that would have been good a while back, but now it's kind of like, kind of meh. Because it's just, yeah. We got the pottery delivery line though, so I think we're actually pretty good. I think, mm, I think it's worth re-rolling this thing first. See if we get a clothier. We didn't. Okay, these people do make packs of provisions and mush soup, however. I think we'll take that. Oh! Oh, that hurt. No, 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 no. I should have taken the other one for the brick production. Yeah. Oh, well. Sad times. <laughs> we can't fix it now. It's like, can't fix it. Okay, so we have the granary. I think what we do, we want to do these packs of provisions. Do we have issues with complex food? Just clothing. It's always the clothing that we can never get. I need another place that makes clothing because I feel like I never get that card. I think I've had it so few, few times. It's really hard. Okay, we're going to do these. And how many provisions do we need? Let's find out. Uh, no, go away. Uh, we need this one. We need 30. Wow, that's a lot. Okay. And we get, we don't get anything very useful. Um, but yeah, that's what we're going to do, I guess. Trade goods and luxury goods. I don't think we can do those. Nigh. Okay, so we'll just do that. Then pick this one and get this. Because I think that we can get easily have that 250 wood available, especially since we can't really do the, uh, the curse. We have the cursed thing going on. So let's see. Pack of provisions. Let's limit that to 30. And we'll just have uh, somebody work on it. The mush soup. Do beavers like mush soup? No. They don't care about this at all. I really, I almost never use, do their things. We don't have anything that makes pickled goods. And biscuits is flour. That is such a, yeah. It seems like it's a, it's a hassle to do that one. But it's okay. I'm not going to go ahead and invite anybody else in until we actually need more employees. Because I feel like we're kind of running at a really good pace right now. We don't actually need more people. So we're lacking on some stuff though. It does, I feel like, did we run out of uh, reeds? We must have. Yeah, we're done. So, but we can make them out of those other things. I think I might need, do we have a, something that grows those? Probably not. I don't think I took any. I didn't take any. Well then, that ain't good. Uh, do we have something that will harvest those, the wheat? Let's see. Herbs, berries, and mushrooms. Grain. All right. Foragers camp. Hooray. Let's take them. We're going to get this camp built. Actually, we'll build it over here and then move it. Okay. This is the granary. Here we have the foragers camp. Very nice cool they are working it okay so herbalist camp oh wow it's it's reporting on us already hmm. 
Uh, okay, herbalists and for what? Huh? That's this one. What about the herbalist camp? Oh, they finished. Okay, so they are all about the berries and the mushrooms and the things and the stuff. We have many things here, though. Herbs. We can farm these. Oh, we can farm these herbs instead of farming the, the herbs. Oh, this is better. Uh, this is actually better, I think. Um, what we can do is put this here so it's faster. I think it's faster to get out. Uh, all right, we need another human here. So if we actually let them do their harvesting uh, or their their things, whatever they need to do. Let's see, at the crude workstation, I can take her off and instead put Beaver on. Beaver should be happier there in any case. So here we can have more humans. Give us a good thing going on there. I didn't even think about the foragers camp. That was very bad of me. I'm like, huh, wow. All right, let's move this again. And what are we getting here? Insects, grain. Yeah, grain for definitely for the... Uh, fiber that we get from this because we have a hundred percent chance of fiber and a 20 percent chance of extra fiber so you know needing fiber in the diet here let's see where other humans are we might need okay we're gonna go ahead and hire people I'll take this group and then we'll get some more another human over here okay and what else do we need to fill jobs for Scavenger's camp is not used. Smokehouse is not needed. Lumber mill. We could have a, another beaver there. I don't really know. I think, I think I actually have enough people. This is a very strange feeling. To have enough. That's very odd. <laughs> I, I'm not, I don't know what to think about it. <laughs> These folks. Um, I think I might build a path here. Yep. That, that's nice. Okay. And of course, we would love to get more of these. Let's put a lizard in here so they can harvest a bunch of stuff. Okay, and well, okay, what happened? Oh, oh, we got a point making the forest angry. Oh, the clothier, oh my god. Yes, we'll take it. We shall take the clothier, hooray. Okay, so let's see. Uh, if we have the fiber down here, you know, it might be worth putting in a, let's see, this can go away, really. This can move, actually, this can, this can move, move stuff. Let's put in a pathway here. And I'm thinking we put in storage over here. Let's put in a storage building right here. And then put a road there, this away. And then I'll put in the clothier here as well. There we go. I'll just cover up this farm. It really doesn't matter. In fact, I can move this there. Yep. So city buildings, storage. No, not storage. Give us the thing. Give us what we want, not what we asked for. Let's go. Okay, there we go. So, clothier, important, manuscripts. Can we use other stuff? Coal for that, but we don't have coal. Can we get coal from this? No, we get crystals from that. Mm, copper, coal? No, no coal. Coal? Nope, no coal. <laughs> it looks like we're not getting coal from this. Just, just an observation, tiny observation there. Um, so we're not going to get the ink, alas. So I think manuscripts are out of the question unless we can buy some coal. Uh, coats are definitely what we want here. And we'll make a limit of 50, I think. So it kind of makes me th wish I had taken the trade on Trader Sahilda for the amber with the coats production. But it's okay. We'll, it'll be fine. We'll just get things. Oh, we satisfied religion. Yeah, I'll take that. Boom. Plus three to global resolve. <laughs> That's so good. All right. And we get grain production and herbs. All the things have happened now. Okay. This is working really well. This is such a, this is a pretty decent uh, run for a hard, hard run. It's looking nice. All the things are good. 
Okay, so this is our granary. Yeah, again, we're needing we are needing that fiber, which is difficult to come by apparently. So here we have two people working on it. Do we have other other fibery things? I think not. Okay. I'm kind of looking around for for stuff. The herb nodes do have fiber potential. What else do we have? Plantation. Oh, hello. You know what? We'll take the plantation. I want it. I want the thing. All right. Of course, we've built over that field, so that's no good. But we can build here and maybe build a storage out here. How many bolts? We have one. We have bolts left. Okay, that's good. We can do our plantation right here. No. Arg. Okay. We have to delete the road, but it's okay. It's all right. Oh, well, this one is... Actually, it's an okay thing. I'm, I was thinking, like, how many bolts we have there. How can... Oh, no, 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 no. Night, night. Do not... Okay, let's get back... The storage. Hello. Okay, there we go. Right there. And then this farm is going to be here. Plantation. Uh, all right, I'm going to go ahead and face it towards the fields. And the reason for that is... Oh, I need to check on this. Can we fix this? No, not in any way. Okay. Um, the reason is that they are going to go and tend the fields much more than they're going to go and deliver. Not that it really matters, because they can just easily deliver, but... Anyway, I think if we do this on higher priority, this is going to be quite good. And we can move this these people over th to this side, and that way they'll deliver the herbs faster. So that's a good one. Okay, we just need those packs of provisions, which the thing has not been built yet, so we really need that fiber. Looks like the storm cannot touch our beavers. They're like, nope, we ain't gonna get less happy. Forget it. So yeah, uh, let's see. Let's un undo this stuff. And I wanna let's see, move this camp just up here somewhere. That'll do. It's nice when you can get some like satellite storage buildings in. It's really nice, actually really nice. All right, what do we got going on here? We've seen that. Um, I always forget which icons are which. I don't know what that is. It looks like kind of a halfway furry beaver face to the side. Might be. Okay. And the squid lady is representative of cards. Okay. Two additional trade routes, but impatience grows faster. You know what? I haven't even looked in the trade routes for the, like the last two how, uh, villages. Well then. Okay. Um... Wow. Okay, that's not good. Over diligent woodworkers. We'll take that one, of course. That's quite a nice one. Let's check out our trade routes. I have not even looked at this. Okay, so they'll send us some spices. Okay. Plus one to global resolve. That's quite nice. Uh, we don't have what they want, do we? Might be. Rocks? No, we don't have rocks. Amber? I'm not going to pay them amber. Forget it. <gasps> 10 rocks a minute? Oh my god, can I give you stuff? Hey, let's have berries happen. You know what? We're having 10 rocks a minute. Let's go. I want them. Oh, we won. Whoops, I didn't even notice. <laughs> it's rough. Okay, so we did get 29 food stockpiles, 5 artifacts, which is fantastic. We need those. We've got Prosperity 3 and Rivalry 1. Go to the world map real quick and see what we can do with stuff. All right, so the next one is here. They want us to go and attack this place. I really want to try these. I'm a bit scared of the no traders, but... I think I also want to go there. Yeah, I might have to do that. Let's see what we can buy in the city for those artifact points. Let's get our deeds, of course. All the uh, XP going on here. Okay, very good. And this one, yay. Okay, that was it. Then we can buy our upgrades. So let's see, what was this again? Okay, so this was Zorg, the trader. 
Uh, cooked and raw food, pottery, tools, as well as perks and blueprints tied to agriculture. So I haven't seen many blueprints, I have to say, but um, those are kind of nice. The rain mill is also nice. They can produce flour very well and manuscripts also. Um, we need something that makes ink, I think. Or no, we, we have something that makes ink. Never mind. Okay, provisioner is also something we don't have. Right now we have 56 uh, breads. So what else did we want that costs these guys? Common hall. Oh yeah, that was the thing, but the, nothing is free in that one. Okay, mist piercers. I don't care about that. What is this one? This is Sothra the Ancient Mammal Habitat. Oh my god. That would be really nice. I'm wondering if that gives the extra bonus for stuff. Where did we have these as essential buildings? That is only a blueprint though. These two places. I wonder though if this gives happiness. I'm kind of wondering. I don't know if it does and I'm like, uh, is it worth it? Is it not? It's also just a blueprint. It's just random if we get it or not. So I'm not sure what that's about, but hmm. I'm kind of, yeah, I'm kind of wondering what we should buy, actually. Let's go ahead and go for, do we want this or do we want to save for this? Allows you to pick a reputation reward from a larger set of options. So that would give us one more card thing. Instead of three, we would see four, I think. Hmm. I think we might get there. All right, so we need two more upgrades to get to the next level of stuff. What do we have here? Meat specialization. Meat production time is increased by plus one. Okay. Butcher, jerky, skewers, and offerings. Oh, that would be nice. I think we need skewers for the beavers, maybe? I can't remember. I don't remember what they like. Okay, so scribe would be nice. Um, let's see, education being free at the temple. That is also very nice. Let's see, we finally see offerings at the scribe there. We have a metal delivery line, two copper bars per minute. I feel like I almost never do the copper bars and tools thing. I'm not quite sure why. Okay, so enriched amber, let's see. Amber is now worth 25% more to traders. Hello, that's nice. <laughs> Okay, Artisan. Oh my god, this is what we want. Okay, so we want Dim Square, level 4, can produce ink, coats, barrels, and training gear. Coats is only one star though, so that may not be a good option. Gosh, there's so many things here that we kind of... Oh, there's just so many things here, aren't there? Alright, what is this again? This is our Zorg... Hmm... One of the coats. We have to buy two before we get to the other thing. Um, yeah, I don't want... I'm good. Thanks. Bye-bye. I'm just like, nope. <laughs> Definitely a nope there. Let's see. Brick oven, pottery, mush soup, coal. That, that would be a nice one to get. Another mush soup thing. But it's very poor in quality. I think it's just because it has so many uh, items. However, it can produce coal. Which is kind of nice, because if you can produce coal, then you can produce ink. And I assume it's charcoal from wood or something similar. So this is a nice thing to have if you're going for manuscripts. Ooh, that's very tempting. Um, you can also have one more trade route. Let's see. Do we have any other 20s that we want? Huh. A stack of wealth effect plus one to each time you trade a lot of goods. A market has free brotherhood. Man, it's so hard to decide on stuff. I think we're going to go for this one. Let's unlock this. Is there anything we want for 20? Well, there's this one, but I don't want that one. I don't, I am, I'm almost like, I don't want to take that one because I don't want to have that in the, uh, in the pool of stuff that I have to get. Cause so far we have seen issues with getting too many bad ones. So that's not good. 
The provisioner, let's see, building materials, coats, and flour. I think this might be worth getting because we get more embark points. So I'm going to unlock this. And we're kind of now at zero again. So, but we have moved up a level, which gives us all kinds of other stuff. The reputation thing. We get the temple, which has education free. Um, meat specialization. Yeah, all of these good things. These are nice things and I want all of them. Yay. <laughs> I want all the things. So anyway, we'll have to figure out what we're going to do in the next episode. So anyway, thank you so very much for joining me. Take care of yourselves and each other, and I'll see you next time.